Hello everyone, this video is about a package for ROS2 which you can use to send video from your webcam, a USB camera or even an IP address onto as a ROS2 topic which you can use for other works such as an OpenCV program or anything related to computer vision. So it's quite simple to install this package and I've uploaded this on the GitHub as you can see you can just uh, clone this repository and build it and start away so i'm just gonna go through a step-by-step -step procedure uh, which can help you install this package uh, and this step would be universal for any ROS2 package so it would be quite easy for you to understand and other than that i have added the readme file which has everything step by step so if you go through this you are all set uh, no need to even watch this video so for the tutorial's sake, I'm just going to go through step by step. So before we begin, I would just like you to know I'm doing this on a Linux system. And if you're having Windows or WSL, that would also be very much fine. There would be no problem with it. So I have Ubuntu 22.04 version, uh, which is the latest version. And I've installed ROS2 Humble. Uh, so before we begin with this, I would request you to install the ROS2 desktop version uh, because it has all the necessary extra packages as well. Uh, if not, then no problem, we can install them step by step. So let's start with uh, cloning this repos repository and starting with it. So I'm just going to follow the readme file here. Uh, so you can see that there is a, you have to create a workspace. So let's create a workspace and we'll keep it any name. So I'm keeping it as ROS2 workspace and you have to uh, name the other file as SRC. So uh, since I have that uh, workspace already with me i'm just going to go inside that and then there would be one more uh, you have to also create one more uh, directory that would be src so i have that as well so i'm going to go inside it so now i'm in inside this src folder i have to clone the repository now so you just have to type the command uh, git clone and the https of this repository so you can just copy it and paste it and then press enter so for me it the package already exists so i don't need to clone it so for you you, you can just clone it and keep it with you and now once you have cloned the repository since it's there already so as you can see my camera is already there now we're going to start to build it so building it is a pretty simple step so all you have to do is just copy this uh, build command and you're good to go um, yep so we, we, we're going to use callcon. So once you enter this command and press enter, it's going to prompt you to install callcon. So just do uh, sudo apt callcon and then you will have it. So for me, this command causes an error uh, because it executes parallelly and it takes up my memory. So uh, there is another way to sequentially execute it. So we have to add an uh, argument. Okay, and then my package is select camera, so that's about it. You can use this command or the other one, see which one works. Uh, so for me, this one is working. So once you run this, it will build the package that you have. So yeah, it takes a small time. Yep, now it's built. So we have the package built in our system. Now we need to go back to this uh, ROS2 directory. And now always remember to source your files. Now sourcing is quite important to let the terminal know that you will be using ROS2 packages. So I'm just going to type this source install load setup. Okay. Yes. Now you source it. Now you are, you are ready to use the nodes. So uh, one of the nodes that is uh, first basic one will run ROS2 run my camera, the package name and then the ROS, the node name. So I've named it as webcam node. So now it is running. I'm not able to see it, but it is running. So I'm going to split the terminal A new terminal. I'm going to open one more command and this is to view the image uh, that is being streamed. So this is the command. So this is ROS to run IQ to me. This will be, uh, this will come pre-installed in the, uh, the desktop version of ROS2 so you don't have to install it even if it prompts your message just sudo apt8 and it will be done with you so now i'm going to open uh, the viewer so hey this is me 
so here you can see the webcam footage it's quite smooth you can see there's no latency it's very less latency it should be like that so uh so this is your image right now and you can also use other images so what i'm going to do is i'm going to show you how you can stream images from your mobile phone onto your camera onto your desktop so i have this app installed it's called ip webcam on android play store so once you have this app installed you can just start a server there and it's going to start a video footage okay and that video footage would have an ip on it okay so i'm going to enter that ip address so let's just uh, for the sake of it let's just open a new terminal and here i'm going to uh, type the command so yes so before i use it make sure to source this terminal so source install local setup dot bash yep so i'm gonna source it and now i can use the ros to run um, my camera and i stream node and in this uh, I'm gonna put an argument of the IP and I'm gonna type the IP address so the IP address should be visible on the app so you just have to type it so it's gonna be 192.168.0.180 and then you have to also add the port number which is mentioned on the website so now i have uh, run the node so if i just uh, create <laughs> oh there's many terminals um, no problem yep no problem okay so i'm gonna just list the ros to topic list you can see that there are one is a webcam image and one is the ip stream image so i'm just going to go here and select uh, just to reload this and you can see an ip stream image coming from the camera so this is uh, this is the uh, this is the feed that is coming from the camera so here i have connected so make sure this laptop and your phone is on the same uh, same network then only it will it will connect or else it won't connect so now i'm going to put this stream onto my robot so you can see uh, some things yes so this is the stream is also very smooth so that's how you can use uh, all the commands there is also one more node which is for any usb camera um, which you can use um, for any FPV camera which you can connect to your laptop and you can use it to stream that uh, video so um, enough of this we're gonna sh I'm gonna show you an implementation of this node so I'm gonna cancel my stream here yep and I have the IP stream open now what I'm gonna do is that I'm going to uh, run a, com a file this is also one package that i have uh, in my src folder so what is the ip stream yeah so what is the image input that i'm going to put that is the ip stream image okay so this is one of the topic that i am adding and there is one okay yeah so i have i launched this file oh, okay so it, we are showing this error because i forgot to source my folder so install look and set up tar bash okay so now it should run okay it's running uh however okay so now i'm gonna go to the I'm gonna refresh this and i'm gonna show the image out okay so now it is supposed to track this uh ball but i think it's because of the lighting so let me adjust the lighting You can see that the ball is being tracked and this is what i'm using it so you can see the output stream the one which is after process which is processed by opencv that's also quite smooth and you can use it for your robot applications like tracking this ball on a 
robot so this is what i've shown i've shown the implementation of a video on my youtube channel um there's one more video about esp32 robot so that uses this concept so this is how you can get started this is how you can use it so it's quite simple and really fun so i hope this tutorial was very much helpful uh, make sure you can subscribe to make sure you subscribe to my channel and uh, put your comments for any recommendations or any requests for different videos the link to the repository i have mentioned under the video description so you can check that as well and thank you so much for watching this